Cheers, man. Take it easy, mate. Antonio, how are you doing? I'm doing good, man, but I've got a bone to pick with you. Cool. Okay. Earlier you said uh, this pointing of fingers has to stop and then you immediately pointed the finger at me about narcissism. Yeah. What are you talking about? I'm talking about the content that I put out um, and within 24 hours you had, you had mimicked the content. Whether or not that was something innocent, I don't know. But, you know, that's questions I have. Okay, so by, by mimicking the content you mean you read out from a list of stuff regarding narcissism and I actually yeah. exposed a narcissist in the flat earth. That wouldn't actually count as mimicking. If I had read stuff out too, then yeah, that would be a legitimate yeah. claim. But this is not a legitimate claim. I'd been thinking about this for days since she'd left because I was left in a position where I could say something that nobody else can say because nobody else has had that subjective experience. Yeah. But, you know, to me, it's totally irrelevant anyway. You know, uh, Antonio, that was the point I was making. To talk about that um, and then take, you know, take it and then start disclosing your private affairs with some women, um, which is totally subjective and absolutely fuck out of day with the, the whole thing. Is it uh, nothing to do with the flat earth? Is she not a flat earth character? No, your, 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 your um, subjective experience of her and your private affairs really has no relevance to it whatsoever apart from... So, so if you knew yourself, it, sorry, I didn't mean to talk over you. If you knew yourself, for sure, 100%, because you had personal subjective experience of somebody being a psychopath, you would yeah. keep that to yourself, would you? Well, you know, I wouldn't bring it to this. I have many issues and subjective things that go on in my life, but I remove it from this whole thing, you know? Mm -hmm. um, but that's just me. But again, mate, you know, you each to their own. You're entitled to your platform and your journey. I'm no, you know, I'm no there to shut you do not tell you you can't do this or do that. I've spoke candidly and openly about how I viewed things, and, and that's it. If I'm misinterpreting it and I'm wrong, my hands are up, fine, I'm wrong. There's no biggie. Flat Earth Asshole made a video a couple of weeks ago about the Blue Marbles missing continents. Two years after, I made a video about the Blue Marbles missing continents. Yeah. I haven't gone up there, said, look, he's plagiarizing, okay? Yeah. There's a possibility that two years after I made that, he made that, I just arrived at the same conclusion. That's well, a possibility. That's There's also the possibility that he saw it, he thought people might have forgotten by now, I'll do it afresh. There's yeah. also that possibility. Just like there's the possibility that your pressure differential between the atmosphere and the lack of atmosphere up there came from me pointing out that they don't know the boundary conditions of the atmosphere two years ago. Could have been, mate, but that's not the case, you know. But you, you're, you're quite right, but what the, the, the point is, is that I'm hearing how I feel, how I view things, which is just an honest, you know, um, account of, you know, who I am and what goes on in my mind sometimes. And things, that's fair enough. Things that's can be done. But when I, the reason I haven't made a video about Flat Earth a Asshole almost replicating my video. Now, you could call that mimicking, okay? He's yeah. almost replicated it. The reason I haven't done that is because I know that shit happens, that people yeah. come across the same idea. Yeah. Now, maybe, maybe you could also voice that when you see me talking about very personal, very pertinent experiences, yeah. with Patricia Steer, who's a mouthpiece for the Flat Earth, yeah. warning people out there about her, you might consider that that has got fuck all to do with you discussing narcissists. I've been looking at narcissists for freaking weeks from people like Gandhi and uh, Leslie um, and Lindsay and other people who were passing me links, okay? And your video was one that I watched towards the end, but you were looking, going over something that one of the other women in uh, that exposed narcissists were going over anyway. Yeah. Okay, so... What, what are you doing accusing me of plagiarizing your stuff? Well, as you say, Antonio, you, you've, just, you've just totally went over what I've just said. I've just told you that I gave an honest account of what I've been thinking, whether it be paranoia or whatever. I'm just going to be transparent about my experience and exactly what I'm thinking. So I've just said that to you. If you're coming and saying it's blah, 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 fine, I accept that. That's why I don't make videos going, he stole this from me and he stole that from me. But when I was in the conversation with, with Matthew, I heard the way I was thinking. And the way I could look at things. So Yes, yeah, but even there you compared your experience over the last two years getting shit because I know that as a YouTube content provider we get shit. 
Yeah. You've compared your experience with his 10 years experience, with him getting run over and beaten to fuck, with his wife getting stopped. You've compared your experience with his. What are you doing? It doesn't compare. What are you talking about? You compared, you said to him, yeah, you, everybody gets shit. Yeah. Yes, we do get shit. But you can't compare your shit with his shit. Well, why, why, are you for, why are you talking for Matthew, man? You no, I'm talking him. for me. This is my feeling. Well, don't, this is my don't bring, thoughts. Well, don't bring him into my, No, you don't get to control what I do or don't bring up. Well, I'm, not, I'm not here. I've had my discussion with, with, with Matthew. And yeah. you're, talk, you're talking for Matthew. Didn't as if you bring you know, me up to him. You're talking about him as if you know him and you know every account for the last 10 years of his life. Wait a second. You just said to me to not bring up Matthew. When you were talking to Matthew, you brought me up. What do you mean? But I, uh, but but I, what I just said, you're a hypocrite, man. How am I? And it lets you down because you're doing good fucking work. Ma, ma, no, Antonio, I'm not a fucking hypocrite. I don't talk fucking shit, my man. I'm you here just talking. Said that. To you just, I'm talking you just to you said fucking to me. directly, you lying fucking piece of shit. I'm talking to you fucking directly. So don't come in and fucking twist it. I'm okay, so. Hypocrite. You're here fucking talking to me, you fucking ignorant prick. So you just said you're lying piece of shit. Uh, describe what lie. You just fucking tried to misrepresent me like I'm a hypocrite. The, you, you just said to me, don't bring up Math Powerland. When you were talking yeah. to Math Powerland, no. you brought me up. He didn't bring me up. You and brought me up. And you're here fucking having the discussion. Yes, and you brought me up. And then but later you told me not to bring other people up. That's no. hypocrisy. You're bringing yeah. it up. You're bringing it up, saying you're talking for Matthew and his ten years. Experience. No, I didn't say that. That's you. You like just it. fucking say that a minute ago. No, I didn't. I did not say. Fuck, I did not say. I did not say. I was Get speaking for Matt. I did not say that, and people listening to this will see. Fucking I, rewind I, I You just fucking referenced his ten years' experience as if you fucking know what he's been through. You yeah. don't fucking know his experience for ten Does years. Does that mean that I was you talking for like him? Does that mean that I was talking, talking for him? That's what I'm talking about. You just said that I said I was talking for him. No, I fucking didn't. You fucking just referenced his 10 years experience. Yes. And once you brought me in 10 years, and, how the fuck do you know? And did I at any point say I'm talking for him? So what's the 10 years about what you're talking about? You need to... Take a breath, okay? Don't I'm fucking start people. telling me I need to take a breath. You get yourself to fuck, you manipulative little fucking prick, you. You have sat in your fucking ass causing more drama than anybody. You fucking yes. knob. Piss you off. Make, you you're make a video funny. Get today, to fuck you out here. Today, you, to make today you make a video. Today, you make a video. Fucking me knob. We antagonising fucking prick that you are. I don't give a fuck if I fucking lose it with fucking knobs like him. I fucking hold my horns up and say blah, 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 blah. And he's still always got a fucking wee bee in his bonnet. Get to fuck you, wee fucking girl, you. You fucking had your opportunity. You come in and fucking speak to me. I'm not hiding for anybody. Fucking wee knob. Take your fucking, your, your emotional fucking drama with your fucking partner and get it to fuck. That was the point of fucking making. I don't give a fuck about your subjective shite with your partner. You can come back here and speak to me any other time you fucking like, boy. Fucking knob cheese. I think that about covers it, Dal, doesn't it? Yeah. So, people, you know, I'm not going to fucking try and justify me getting pissed off and irate at this. Look, if I have done something wrong, which I do, and I'll ha ha hold my hands up to it, I fucking admit it. But rewind the fucking thing. Don't come in here and start talking about people as if you're representing them in their 10-year fucking history when you don't fucking know their 10-year history. Right? That's the bollocks bit. And he fucking knows fine well that's what I was talking about. So straight away, you know, this character comes in with his wee fucking boy. Ooh, I've got a bone to pick with you. Do, 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 do. He gets his bone to pick. I hold my hands up and say, fair dues, you know, I can look at it this way. I've heard how I see things, blah, blah, blah. That's not good enough. No, he wants to compound it and compound it and make you. Oh, I'm so sorry, Antonio. Fuck you, you fucking wee prick. I will bow to nobody. No fucker. 
You'll get my fucking attention, and I will hold my fucking hands up and have discussions with you. But no one you come in as a divisive little fucking manipulative gimp, right? You got me fucking saying, no bother, fair do is I hold my hands up. If I've been misinterpreted it, I looked at it the wrong way. Fine, I heard my concerns. I don't make hit piece videos about these subjects. I say to Matthew, ah, that's the way I think about it, and I could look at it like this. Go and fucking listen to it. So when I do that, and I give you that fucking respect and decency to say, by the way, I find, fair enough, I've looked at it wrong, don't then keep trying to fucking pound it. You're just showing your true colours, you're controlling little fucking prick, you. I ain't gonna bow a buckle for you, or no cunt, right? If you're standing in front of me, I'd fucking smash you right in the fucking beat, you wee prick. Fucking wee knob, you. So there you go, Odell's cracked again. Fuck you! Dell has fucking cracked. I don't part with shit like that from fucking nobody, right? You come at me as a fucking man and you ask me to take responsibility for a wrongdoing and I say, fine, no problem, I, I looked at it wrong, fair enough, blah, blah. And then you keep your own like a wee fucking bitch. You're going to get fucking backhanded right away, you clown. Get to fuck, you troublemaking little fucking bastard, you. Record this and fucking use it. Look at Dell, the fucking loony. I don't give a fuck. Medication time. Oh, Dale needs medication. He's a fucking psycho. No, I'm a fucking man with fucking morals and standards and principles. And I'll fucking stand on him, defend him, and I'll fucking deed. Right? You cunts. You want to fucking push buttons with a man? This is what fucking happens. As I say, you know, I wore my tone now. If I take responsibility and I say, fair enough, I've looked at it wrongly, that should be it. No bother. All right, cool. No bother, man. Misunderstand. It's fine, fine, fine. No, no for these manipulative wee fucking gimps, these little bitches with a fucking twisted mind. No, that's no good enough, I want to, I want to show people that you're a hypocrite and that, that you're no perfect. I know I'm no perfect. I make mistakes. Do you think I'm sitting here trying to make out that I'm some sort of fucking god? Huh? There's some fucking drama for people to take. Some fucking belters in there. This is what they want. They want to try and tear me down. They want to try and paint me in a certain light and oh, look at Dale's attitude and Dale's behaviour, that's not acceptable and blah, 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 blah. Fuck off. Nobody has a fucking objective truth. Nobody has a fucking keys to reality and know how you should behave and how you shouldn't behave. I'm just a man experiencing what I'm experiencing. You can take it and ram it all up your fucking ass. Antonio. I held my hands up. I gave you that fucking time and you still went on like a little fucking whining bitch. That's no good enough. You're a hypocrite man. You're a hypocrite man. Fuck off. Fucking fanny. <clears throat> Antonio should have left it at that, no need to bring up stupid drama again and again. Well, this is it, we Antonio, He's, he likes a wee bit of that, you can see his wee fucking smarmy, smirky fucking face. Right? He got what he fucking came in for. And I say that I'm wrong. Right, fine. I've, I've looked at it the wrong way. That should have been the end of it. Antonio. This is what a psychopath looks like. No, that's not what a psychopath looks like. A psychopath will, will portray themselves to be smiling and always together and blah, 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 blah. We're really in secret if they've, they've got other fucking things. I'm showing you directly exactly what goes on with me. I'm not going to fucking hide anything. I'm just a man with a fuse the same as anybody else. And if you keep fucking pushing a light that fuse, then I'm going to fucking explode. Flatter female, what have I missed? You've not missed anything, everything was, was, was chugging along fine until we had Antonio in, who wanted to pull me up because, uh, you know, I made a claim that he, he maybe plagiarised something that I used. And then um, he came in and he explained it his way and I went, right, no problem, I probably looked at it the wrong way. And at the same time, I'm only hearing how I was thinking to fucking Matthew. Uh, so I've held my hands up, but he wasn't happy with that. He wanted to try and keep, you know, belittling me. 
to make me go, okay, Antonio, are you, are you, are you, I'll kill her into my wee fucking shell. Fuck off. So that's what you've missed. Remind it. I'm sure it's going to be everywhere now. <laughs> Pretty sure the people in chat can see exactly what happened there, though. Yeah. Exactly. Oh, well, fuck it. They'll, they'll use it for whatever fucking way they want. This is the stuff that, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll be expecting it. You know? And Antonio, he can def he's not got any fucking defence. If he goes away and makes fucking videos, then that shows you who he is. If I say something, he asks for the link, he comes in and he speaks to me directly because, as I said, I'm not going to hide for anybody. Right? And as I said before, if I'm wrong, if I've looked at it in the wrong way, I will hold my hands up. What you done? I don't know what's fucking hard for him. <laughs>